Testing. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Hey, thanks, baby. Yes, it's my wife. Hi. Hey. Okay, have fun. Have thank fun. you. Thank you. Welcome to our home here in Singapore. And welcome back, East Asia Super League fans, to Full Court Press, your source for the top basketball headlines this side of the Pacific. I'm your host, Boom Gonzalez. Come with me, and I'll fill you in on the top hoops headlines. Let's get it rolling with the PBA, baby. Both the Miralco Bolts and TNT Tropang Giga came up with inspiring basketball to level their PBA semifinal series at two games apiece. In the first game, the Miralco Bolts were able to fend off their bitter rivals, Parangay Ginebra, to earn a deciding fifth game, which will be played tomorrow evening. In the main game, TNT Tropang Giga refused to go home as it relied on its firepower to level the series with the Phoenix Fuel Masters at 2 all. Friday can't come soon enough as both series are headed to a fifth and deciding game. Who you got? The P League had its first ever exhibition games in Taizhong and had some major fans on the sidelines, including superstar Jay Cho. <laughs> The Fulpon Braves went off. They won both games by over 30 points, and the club's lineup is scary. Jeff Chang returned to the court and had 44 points combined. And the captain, Lin Qixie, looked like a young gun, contributing 18 points and 9 boards in the key game against the Dreamers. Can anyone stop this team? You know what to do. Comment down below. The newly established Sinchu Lioneers are not to be overlooked though. They took down the Tao Yuan Pilots and Oscar Kao is an all-around player. The kid nearly had a triple-double, 16 points, 9 boards, and 9 dimes. The CBA, B-League, and KBL are all on a break from games during the FIBA window. However, according to media sources, originally scheduled to be held in Qatar have been postponed until February next year, and the venue will be changed to Japan. The KBL Draft 2020 took place on the 23rd with 24 new players coming to the KBL. Cha Min Siok was selected first overall by the Seoul Samsung Thunders. The kid is the first ever high schooler to be drafted first overall in KBL history. Now let's take a look at the top teams from around the region and tell us how does your team stack up? Thanks for watching, everyone. Be sure to join us next time for more EASL Full Court Press. I'm your host, Boom Gonzalez. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you again next time.